Well, you know, for July, it's Jelina, right? You've heard of that, haven't you? And what is that? You just, you don't shave down there? You don't wax? <laughs> um, apparently. I've, this is the first I've heard of it. I guess this year is the first year of it. And my cousin said, oh, you supporting Jelina. And I'm like, what, like, what are you talking about? Like, why would you ask me that? I don't even know what that is. Like, are you making something up? And then he's like, just go on a website. And Jelina. I'm kind of apprehensive to go on websites when my cousin, who's, you know, 22 and perverted, when he tells me to go on a website, I'm kind of like, He iffy. told you about it? Yeah, because oh. I guess girls told him about it, and he was just like, "Oh, is that a real thing?" Like, you know, I thought he was tricking me. I'm, he... I'm pretty sure he's making it up. He's probably really no, it's, attracted it's to real. you. It's pro- real. And I went on it. Jelina. Jelina. You're sure it's, it's real? You sure he just it's, never? I'm sure he never no, made up the website July, because he's, then, he likes and, you. He's attracted to you. Maybe he wants to no, take you my out. Cousin. That's disgusting. He's your cousin. Yeah. So why would your cousin like you and make something up like this? No, I don't get it. Going with this? No, I'm serious. It raises awareness for cervical cancer, so, and apparently you're supposed to, you know, um, how do I say this? Quaff down there in some manner, and they give you different. <laughs> they show. They give you pictures. Quaff. Like, so they want you to look like um, Gandalf from Lord of the Rings in the month of perhaps, July. Perhaps. Perhaps. For and it's, I think they chose a really terrible month because that's bikini season. So why would you want girls to grow down there? It just it doesn't make it logically doesn't make sense. Like, why don't you choose a winter month? Yeah, that, that does make more sense. Maybe it, maybe it originated in the States, like down south where it's always summer. I don't know. No, they never thought of us up here. We're no. in Canada, by the way, for anyone listening. Yeah, Canada. Toronto. We'll say Toronto. We're pretty close to there. So. Yeah, we'll say okay. Toronto because no one else knows any other cities in, in that <laughs> area. <laughs> I think, no, I shouldn't say anything about Americans because they're nice people sometimes. I so. will. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll, we'll get to that a little bit later. What about you? You didn't grow any facial hair for um, November. No, did I did. You, I did. I actually, the day before, see, here's a, here's a story between me and uh, my friend Nellie here. We went to college together. We became very good friends and we always kept in touch but there was a long period of time where we didn't recently we we were talking uh how long ago oh man i remember it was like it was yesterday oh wait it was yesterday (laughs) and we decided to come up with this show so this is what it is i had a huge beard the day before that massive you did not you did not why did you shave it It looked like uh because i had an interview and going in there looking like you know jelina or whatever you want to call it (laughs) Just, I don't think, I don't yeah, think. Yeah, but worked. maybe they they would understand that you're supporting a good cause, and that probably would have helped you in the interview. Maybe, but isn't November strictly mustaches, or is it like a whole beard thing? I don't know. I think I think it's supposed to be just the mustache, but I've seen guys grow like the whole thing. Yeah. Who knows? Who knows? I think it's just an excuse not to actually pay attention to your facial hair. Yeah. But speaking of that, um, according to Google Trends, Movember wasn't even in the top five listings. And I have to 